name's Lane Hadlock. I work at Boise Cascade in downtown Boise. When I get off work, I go out, jump in a commuter van, uh, and I make five stops in downtown Boise to pick up uh, passengers. And we jump on the connector and head to Nampa and Caldwell together. I pick up at the Boise Cascade building in front of the Banner Bank building. I go to the uh, Health and Welfare on State Street. I go down and pick up at St. Luke's Hospital. And then my final stop is at the Ada County Courthouse. We uh, jump on the connector there at the courthouse and uh, head out the connector, hit the freeway at the Flying Y and head to Nampa. We stop in Nampa and we also stop, uh, next stop is at the south of Caldwell, just outside of Caldwell. I've been driving uh, Vanpool for 16 years. Uh, first two years I was affiliated with Vanpool, I was a rider and the opportunity came available to drive and I volunteered to do that. There's no cost, you act as a volunteer, you do responsible for gassing up the the van and keeping it clean and you know, washed at least twice a month and uh, keeping track of your uh, passengers and uh, dealing with recruiting new passengers and encouraging others to participate in the van pool. I started a van pool about 12 years ago when I was at Health and Welfare um, because I, I hated the drive by myself. Um, I'm really passionate about the program. I think that it is so critical to this valley to get people off the road. I can't stand the fact that every car you see has one person in it. It drives me completely crazy. Um, the pollution is bad. The roads are bad. There's no money to fix the roads. And it, it's just, it's a, it's a really important critical program. Plus, my, my own road rage is reduced because I'm in the van with people who you know, we're talking or we're sleeping or singing or whatever we're doing and it's just so much less stressful to drive with other people. Yeah, I, I feel like uh, you know, everybody who's riding with me, I'm taking a car off the road and uh, decreasing that congestion. So anything I can do to help really alleviate that traffic congestion, I feel, I feel glad to do. Yes, I keep the van at my house uh, over the weekend and at nights, uh, keep it off the street for safety purposes and, uh, and just, just uh, store it there. Yeah, often friends and associates who are at my house see the van pool park there and uh, they ask me if I do that for a living. I say no, I just volunteer and uh, I explain to them how much money I'm saving and uh, that I go with 11, 12 other people to Boise every day and, uh, and it works out real well for us. cost me ten thousand dollars a year to drive my own vehicle as opposed to less than a thousand to ride in the van well right now just in cost of gas I'm, I'm saving at least a hundred dollars a month and that doesn't count the wear and tear on the vehicle and plus it would I like in the 16 years I've driven I probably would have wore out at least three cars in that time They jump in their car and make the short commute home to their home in Nampa. It's, it's a nice little group of acquaintances that get along well. Um, we don't have any, you know, quarrels about you're in my seat or anything like that. Um, just everybody accommodates each other. Just, it's a really nice group. Yeah, the more people we can get on uh, the van pools, car pools, and buses, uh, the less congestion we have and the less uh, pollution we have in our air. It's good for the environment. It's good for the air, it's good for the roads, and it's, it's a really a good program.